It is a triple tragedy for our state. Three of the seven Marines aboard that chopper that went down during a training exercise in Florida were from Michigan. 24 News 8 Susan Samples is live with is at the live desk with where the investigation stands and what else we know about those on board. We learned today that two Metro Detroit natives were also believed to be on board the chopper when it went down off the coast of the Florida Panhandle. Also believed on board, as we've reported, Holland native and decorated Marine Staff Sergeant Andrew Seitz. The other two Michigan natives on board, 27-year-old Marcus Baywall of Warren and Trevor Blaylock of Lake Orion. In fact, while the Department of Defense confirmed Baywall and Blaylock's deaths to their families, it has not yet done so with Seif's family. According to military Military members camped outside the family's home. Sife's status is still unknown. Meanwhile, in Florida today. At this point, we are not hopeful for survivors, and we are transitioning our search and rescue operation to a recovery. The UH-60 Army helicopter went down in thick fog during a training exercise over the Santa Rosa Sound. It was uh, certainly a high impact uh, crash, so we do have uh, a lot of debris. Last night, a candlelight vigil was held to remember those on board and support their families. It just brings this community closer together to make sure that we all know that even though some people are gone, that we're all there for each other. As we told you yesterday, Sergeant Seif was named 2013 Marine of the Year and was awarded the prestigious Silver Star just last week. Back to you.